I was mad. At myself. At Provora. At Mona. Was she worth this? It was all connected. The murder of Senator Gate, the cleaners, the inner circle, Vinnie Gogniti. I had to make Winterson see it. Winterson's phone was ringing. She wasn't at her desk. Winterson's phone. Better get Winterson. She's been kind of edgy about her calls. Number one, thank you. You may step back. They can't see you through the glass. Just take your time. See if you can recognize any of them, okay? Yeah, okay. I wanted to talk to Winterson's witness once she was done with him. Hey, we were watching that, asshole. And now, Get out of the way, Payne. Hey, him, nice going, Kane. Good job. One armed bandit. Aren't I supposed to identify any of the men in jumpsuits? That's none of your concern. Just concentrate on the task at hand. Do you recognize any of them? Yeah, number three's the one. Thank you. Okay, we're done. Take them away. Okay, ladies, you heard her. This way. You can wait here. Someone will come to get you once the paperwork is done. Detective Payne, anything you'd like to add? As I was trying to tell the other detective, the place was crawling with guys in gray overalls. They sure as hell weren't cleaning the place, but she wasn't too keen on listening to me. It's hard to say who was out to kill who, but the chick I just fingered and the men in jumpsuits, they got into a serious firefight. Okay, thanks. No, thank you. They're taking the fall, both of them. Payne was with her when she was arrested. Who are you talking to? You're leaking information. Bravura's too soft on you. I was informing the proper authorities on what they should know. Stay away from my case, Max. Stay away for your own good. Everything had started out as black and white. Somewhere down the road, the line went blurry. The colors started to run, got smudged and gray. Winterson had been above my suspicion. It felt like a goodbye. Go away, I'm busy. Some of us have work to do. The lineup was done. Mona was back in her cell. The cells were downstairs. Wanna get to the lockup? Just press the buzzer by the door. Petersburg will buzz you in. Pain here. I need a statement from one of your customers. Mona Sachs. <laughs> Not again. Max, you've gotta get me out of here. You know I can't do that. If I stay here, I'll die. Isn't that a bit melodramatic? Behind bars, I'm a sitting duck. This is as safe as it gets. Come on, Max. Any one of these cops could be on the Inner Circle's payroll. You should know. What's that supposed to mean? You know Alfred Woden. You want answers? Call him. He'll verify everything I've told you. Okay, I'll do that. I didn't want to have anything to do with Woden. Can I use your phone? I need to make a call. You can use this phone. Play You've around? reached the voicemail yes, no, no. of Senator Alfred Woden. Please leave a message. Woden, Max Payne. We need to have a talk. You ask me, you still owe me. Jesus Christ! A bomb? That was a bomb! Upstairs, now! <coughs> Jesus! Upstairs, now! Something was off. Mona's words on her being a sitting duck kept playing in my head. The bomb had misdirection written all over it. Drop it! Oh! Armed perps in the locker. Officer down. Take him down. Find the bitch. Find her. Kill her. NYPD, drop your gun. Ah! 
Mona had been right. I had to go after her. I needed a gun to get past the cleaners. Staying here, trapped behind a desk, would have solved nothing. Mona had vanished into the night. Without her, I had nothing to go on. I knew where to find her. <laughs> 